this is ISI 2023 PA question number three. Consider a market demand function P is equal to 100 minus Q, where P is the market price, Q is the aggregate demand. There are 23 firms and each firm has a cost function of QI square by 2. The Kurno-Nash equilibrium is what? So let's go on the white code and solve it. So we know that <clears throat> N is equal to 23, P is equal to 100 minus Q is the aggregate demand that we have. C is equal to QI square by 2. Okay. This capital Q is nothing but 23 into QI. Because you will realize because the cost function is the same for each and every firm. This ith firm output is the same as each and every output. Anyway, we'll come to that just by looking at profit of i. 100 minus summation j not equal to i q j minus q i into q i minus q i square by 2. Differentiate 100 minus summation j not equal to i q j minus 2 q i minus q i is equal to 0. Now, this is the first order condition from the profit equation for every ith firm. <clears throat> So this holds for all i, which is equal to 1, 2, up to 23, right? Now, <clears throat> this thing will hold for q1 also, q2 also, q3 also. So ultimately, I'll get the same equation for each and every firm. So what you'll get is qi is equal to, say, q, where i is equal to 1, 2, up to 23. The quantity produced by each firm will be the same because the profit equation is similar for each firm. So ultimately, what will I get? I'll get basically 100 minus, this is n minus 1. So n minus 1 is 22q minus 2q minus q is equal to 0. 22 plus 2, 24 plus 1, 25. 100 is equal to 25q, q is equal to 4. So this is the quantity produced by each firm and the total quantity in the industry is 23 firms multiplied by each firm producing 4. Total is 92, price is equal to 100 minus 92 which is equal to 8. Right? only this four has been asked, but the other things also, it's important for you to know how to find them. And the answer here is C.